what is up queen mafia family what is up queen mafia squad it's nothing at the bottom of this it's just something at the bottom of the what you call but anyways i'm gonna make some ribs and pork chops but i want to do it a different way you know y'all listen i'm learning how to cook and I, i'm just trying things out okay but anyways so this is what we're gonna need to use don't ask me why I buy no tripod. Let me wash this. Do something different, but this is what I use, okay? So this is the tomato paste we're going to use. We need vinegar, ketchup, mustard, brown sugar, and salt. And if I miss anything, I'll let y'all know in a second. Salt. And then the things I'm trying to pull out is optional. We got this. You can use this. Or this. Tastes like a barbecue. I'm going to use a little bit of that. Not much because, I mean, yeah. And then some pepper because I'm black. Mm -hmm. And some onion forks. So, I'm going to just pour it in here how it goes. I only got one hand, sadly, but truly. Don't ask why I'm getting no tripod, I don't. Because, I mean, like, a tripod is only, what, $10 to $20, and I still only get one. I mean, I had so many, and they broke, and I just never got it again. But, anyways. So, one cup of ketchup, that's what I'm starting with. Listen, this might not be how y'all do y'all, and that's completely fine, but this is how I'm going to do mine. And this is a lot of ketchup. It's like the whole bottle. My boyfriend and I was doing this. He was like, what in the... But that's one cup, probably like more than one cup, but it's one cup. Hey, that's the ketchup. I want to get all your product out because you're not going to wash it. I mean, waste nothing. Get all that ketchup out. Then I'm going to do my tomato paste. And the brand of the tomato paste is Happy Belly. I really do like that brand. Um, it's a more cheaper brand. It's a more cheaper brand. But they have some good prices, and I'm all for the good prices. So, we got that. Get all of that. And this is six ounces, and you're going to use all of that. And we're going to bake this. She's supposed to put it in a, ro a pot roast. Because I got one, but it's too small. So, that's why I didn't use it. Like, I'm supposed to... I'm gonna put the word in because I forgot what it's called. I mean, I got a little small one, like I do my little roasting, but these ribs and pork chops are really, really big. So, oh my god, it's so hard to get this tomato paste off. Make sure y'all don't waste nothing. Get all of that product out. Prices are way too high to be wasting anything. Okay. And then you need one cup of water. One cup of water. Pour that in there. And then you need two tablespoons, I meant two teaspoons. Well, no, two tablespoons or a teaspoon of mustard. I'm gonna just use this spoon. You know, I'm gonna... Everything's bad because I ain't trying to have the kitchen look a mess. 
And then you need a tablespoon of salt. I'm just using one. Okay. Just add a little more. I ain't trying to add nothing salty. And then you're going to need um, the vinegar and the the brown sugar, but I'm have to wash this out now. And I'm, I'm gonna do the vinegar first because it's gonna get messy. I'm gonna do it. Put half of that in there. So one cup of water, one cup of ketchup, Three fourth cups of brown sugar, one one half cup of vinegar. No, not one half cup. One half teaspoon. Sorry. And then we're gonna do the brown sugar and then I'm getting the brown sugar. And then you don't have to add all this other stuff. I usually add this on top. I'm gonna add some onions and I'm gonna open this because I ain't got time. Some pepper. I need to get my nails done. Pepper. And then some of this barbecue stuff right here. And mix it all up. Alright, I'm gonna get all this mixed in and then I'm gonna get back to y'all. Alright, so I washed the meat, as you can see. So I'm about to season it, like a little light seasoning. I don't know y'all be like, you know, seasoning your food good enough, especially my mom. But anyways, come over here and cook then. Come over here and cook then, okay? But anyways, I gotta learn. I got kids, you know. You know, happy, you know. Okay, but anyways. Um, I gotta make sure my kids and my man eat. That's what I'm trying to say. But anyways, I'm finna lightly season this and... I'm just, I was just thinking I was as I was washing my meat. Somebody told me not to wash my meat. And I'm like, I may know not to cook, but I know damn well you better wash that meat, okay? But anyways, we ain't gonna get to that. But this is what I'm using. Y'all may use something different. I I I really do not like using what I got right here. I hate this. When this is going, I will never buy this again, okay? I usually use other stuff, but I couldn't find it in the store. It was all sold out, so I had to season it, okay? So, I'm gonna just use this, some pepper, some parsley, barbecue, stuff like that. Awesome. So, this is how it looks, y'all. And then I'm gonna season the other side. All right, so this is the other side. I lightly season it because I, I don't be trusting myself sometimes. I really don't, and I can't taste it. So I'm finna pour this sauce on. This is how it look. It looked like a tomato paste, but I tasted it. And I said, "Damn, girl, I did that." But anyways, I did add a little brown sugar. It's kind of like like a, I don't know. But anyways, I wanted to taste. I wanted to taste, I got a cold, so if I'm stirring a lot, it's because of it. But anyways, um, I wanted it to taste more like a barbecue type of thing, so I'm going to pour this on there. And let me take, I'm going to pour it on And remember, this is supposed to go in, that's what it's called. It's called the crock pot. I got one, but it's too small. And I don't know why I'm making all this because I know, I mean, I don't know. But, yeah. So. Hopefully, it doesn't go to waste. Hopefully. It's packed on my team's grandma house. So, it's like... Do what it's gonna have to do basically. Oh, 
Hopefully it's good. Hopefully it is good. And it's supposed to be in a crock pot, so maybe I'll buy a bigger crock pot. But I'll be procrastinating on certain things like I'm broke. But I'll be acting kind of broke to me because I... I just be worrying about my kids, man. I really do. Like, oh, I'll buy it next week and don't buy it. So, yeah. I'm trying to just pull the ribs up so I can get on both sides, being that I didn't add no butter. Or oil you at the bottom. So, it don't dry out too fast. I do got it on really, really low since it's supposed to be in the crock pot. We ain't trying to make it, you know, cook it fast. And then I'm going to cover this with some aluminum foil and let it sit. And then I'm going to show you how it comes out. I'm wearing my boyfriend to sit down and taste something. I'll show you how it tastes because I can run it sometimes. I'm gonna put this in. 